Hey friends, it's Youth Pastor Lee here with my cat Lando. He's been having some fun climbing and now he's putting his claws in my pants. Um, so I know that right now things are really confusing. They are to me anyway. Everything seems so confusing. I don't really know what's going on all the time and I bet you feel kind of the same way. But that's okay. It's okay to not know. It's okay to be confused. One of the great things about not knowing is that you can ask someone else. You can learn from them. There's All of us have a time where we don't know things and it's great to be able to learn. You may feel small or you may feel like you don't quite know what to do. But that's okay because being small is good and not knowing can be equally good. I want to show you something. This is a magnet. The magnet is small, and yet it holds up something big like a paper. Now, the paper, this paper in particular, has our church family in it. Not the specifics of the church family, but random individuals. You got dog, person that's pregnant, an older person family with children, there's a cat. See, see everyone in this? I think it's nice. <clears throat> and then I want to tell you a little story that shows about how not knowing can be okay. I thought I didn't want a cat. I told my wife that we shouldn't get a cat. She said, oh no, it'll be great to have a cat. But I was sure that we shouldn't get a cat. And now the cat is one of the best things in our lives. He loves to claw us. He loves to play with us. He loves to be so cute and to purr. He loves to try to climb on things. He loves to run away. <laughs> so sometimes it's okay to not know. And I encourage you to look for things to be okay with not knowing and to ask others for help. And remember that you too can be strong like a magnet.